Hey everyone, Carol here and welcome to my channel. If this is your first time, welcome. And if it's not, thank you guys for coming back. Appreciate you being here. This is going to be a short video. Um, I, as you know, just recently joined Soap of the Month Club. And I know I just showed one, but I just got this one in the mail. The old second pair of eyes. And this is from Fairmount Soapery. Uh, thank you for your review. All the love, Pam. And um, this, I listed it on the first one that I did. I think I forgot the last one. But this, she's got, uh, okay, email. Uh, she's on the Etsy shop. And um, Facebook. And she's also on Instagram. And they're all at, you know, Fairmount Soapery. So, yeah, the email's uh, Fairmount Soapery at Gmail. I think the best way to get a hold of her would be through Etsy uh, or probably uh, Instagram. That's usually the best way to get a hold of someone. Um, but I'll, I'll list all those information. Um, this is what you didn't get to see the first time because I already had torn into it like a rabid dog. <laughs> it's been hard, too, not to tear into this one. She wraps it in the tissue paper. There's a sticker there. And then the cute little uh, ribbon there. Cordage, as I call it. <laughs> I just think it's so cute. And I'm telling you what, she sends them in these... Uh, bubble wrapper envelopes and it's, it's you can smell it before you ever get into it all right I'm gonna untie it hope you guys had a good Mother's Day um, I always do let me know what you guys did, did you do anything fun I hope so Okay, now let me get in here. I hate ripping this because uh, I, just, I just do. Because it's what's holding it together. But, mm, gosh, these are big bars of soap. I haven't figured out how long it takes to use them yet. But, ooh, okay. This one is Cherry Almond. You guys remember when I did my one and I had the gold nail polish on and you guys said my gold polish matched the honeycomb. Cherry almond. It's not quite matched, but <laughs> pretty good match. Look at that. <laughs> there you go. It must just be how that's the top part where it's the, before it's cut. You can see. I just love the way I'm fascinated by things like that. I really am. You can you can just see where it's been cut and uh, it smells like mm, like a, like wild cherry or cherry cola. That almond in it though. Man, you you can smell that almond in it. I know that because it says that. But if I didn't have that, I would say cherry cola. Black cherry. It smells like black cherry. Approximately 5.4 ounce. Handcrafted in Tennessee. <laughs> I always say it like that. I have family in Tennessee. Y'all are watching? Howdy. <laughs> I'm just kidding. They don't talk like that. They say howdy. Or howdy do. Or we say yens. Oh, yens done. <laughs> My kids get a kick out of that. Okay, this one. Uh-oh. What do we got in here? I love her little sample. This is tea tree and charcoal. And it is a sample. It's got the her QR code in that. I haven't tried it. I'm going to do that after this and see what it's. And I can't quit saying it. I love 
the way that it's shaped, you can see where it's cut. <laughs> it makes it special. Hmm. Kind of has a like a grit, like a dirt smell. But I know for a fact that tea tree is good at getting grease and oil and stuff off. And I bet this would be good for like um of course, a full size. This won't last long. Uh, when your man comes home, you know, to get the dirt off his hands, or us women even. And this one is um, apple mango. Wonder if I got that. These are the cutest little bags that she puts them in too. I love, I love these little bags. Little brown. bag. <laughs> Ooh. Hmm. God. I think I did get this. At, yeah. Apple mango. Pam. Thank you, girl. This is a gift. Because I, are, this, I have this. I don't have that sample, but she's not going to give me something. I'm not, I'm not going to keep buying the same thing over and over and I knew I had this. Hmm. So pretty. I know I got this in the big bar too. That was my very first order. Wow. So pretty. Okay, you guys. That's all I have to show you for Fairmount Soapery right now. But if you're interested, I'll put the, her information in my uh, about. And you can get a hold of her or look on Etsy under um, homemade soaps. She makes them in small batches. And, um, oh, I hope she's going to be able to find the mold to make the ones I'm trying to get for my friend's wedding. But, um, I don't know, it's, it's nice. Our niece did that at her wedding. She gave away little bars of soap and it had... Her and her husband's wedding day and their name, Mr. and Mrs. such and such. And um, I thought that was pretty cool. Still got it. <laughs> All right. Please comment. Uh, hit that like and subscribe. Color in the bell to get the notifications. And I can't wait to see you in my next video. Until then, take care of yourself. Love you guys. Bye.